Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to backup and restore your router. So you need to click on files, click backup and by default, by default all backups are encrypted and this is to prevent um, unauthorized access to your backup because the backup file contains all the passwords for your router and also like user ID, Wi-Fi password, all of those passwords are in the backup file. However, if you don't want to encrypt your backup, you can click check this box that says don't encrypt. However, for, for this tutorial, we're going to encrypt the backup. We're going to give this backup a name. We're going to call it first backup. and a password um, the password uh, we don't need to set a password because by default the backup is it will be encrypted with the password of the router so the same password that you use to log into the router the backup will be encrypted with it however you can actually enter a different password for your router for the backup if you want to but for this tutorial we're we're not going to do that so click backup and now we have created a backup of the router there's another way of doing a backup of your router and that is through the terminal click new terminal and the command to do this backup is export space file equal and the file name so we're going to call this first export and then enter so the ex the difference between export and the regular backup is that the export the file the, the configuration of your router is exported to a text file which is really a script and that script can be loaded back onto your router uh, so I'm going to show you that So there are two files now and in order to view the file we are going to move these files to our desktop so we're going to open your desktop and then we're going to drag click and hold and drag these two files onto your desktop So you realize that the extension one one of the file has a dot backup and the other has a dot rsc so the rsc is is a script file so we're going to i'm going to open it and let you see what what it looks like all right so so this is the file so you realize it's a script so these commands can can be executed from from the terminal so you could actually copy these settings and paste it at the terminal and it will will be applied. So right, let us try and copy this. I'm going to open a new terminal, paste, and then press enter. So see I'm going to change. So you want to change uh, the range so this script allows you to change change co the configuration of your router before importing it so that's one of the advantage of exporting a, as a script versus um, the regular backup so say we're going to use a different range so we're going to use two to say three enter so the pool, so there's a pool that has already already have the name DHCP. So we won't be able to restore it with that name. So you could change it to DHCP2 and press enter. So now we have imported the settings as a as a new DHCP 
pool. So in this tutorial, you don't need to worry about what are what um, what are pools and DHCP and so forth. We we get to that in another tutorial. Uh, in order to restore the regular backup, you would highlight the backup, then click restore, and it will ask you for the password. So the password, you need to type the password for your router right here and then click restore. Then your router will reboot and then the restoration process will start. So that is how you back up and restore your router. And that's it for this tutorial. And stay tuned for more tutorial like this. And thanks for watching.